Hello world, I'm Ben Dana. Nice to meet you. Got some questions. I'm wondering, can you answer like... What's up YouTube down here and welcome to a FIFA 14 Karima player review. So this is something different to my channel. In today's video, we are going to actually have a look at Junior Melander from Wolfsburg. So in today's video, as I say, we'll be having a look at some of his stats and onto some gameplay and showing you how good he is. So here is Junior Melander from Wolfsburg, as I was saying. He's actually 18 years old. He can play as a cam, centre mid, he can play as CDM and even a centre back as well. So he's absolutely insane. You can see that 18 years old and 5 foot 11 as well. And he is insane. And I've actually picked him up during my Arsenal career midway through the first season. And yeah, he's played really well for me so far. And I know a lot of you guys don't actually know about him. And he does actually go on to potential of around about 86, 87. And you're kind of following me on my path as like how I go on uh, with my Arsenal career and see how far he does actually get during my career. So he can see you actually buying him into my Arsenal career mode at the start of the season. You see, just showing you how easy it is to actually buy him. You can see him just accept him in on loan, but into the second season, I will actually buy him uh, for around about, hopefully around about six or seven million, which is absolutely dirt cheap. So in my opinion, he's like the new Yaya Torre, even Paul Pogba as well. He plays similar to them, but he can also play like that centre back. I think it's Kara, who plays, I think, in the uh, Pro League, I think, in the Belgium League. And he's similar to that as well, but he's so, he's so big as well, uh, so strong. Look at that pace as well, 91 strength, and I think it's 85 balance, balance or something like that. And he's absolutely insane, so if you guys haven't checked him out, he is um, absolutely insane. I'm actually going to show you some, uh, some of his stats in more detail going into the squad report. He's just absolutely insane, and I really did enjoy using him. So, in the season, I was kind of using him as a backup centre-back, just because Vermaelen was kind of getting injured a lot, and obviously Mertesacker doesn't have the best of stamina. So I actually used the next to Kishoni, and them two together were so good. Obviously, Kishoni has a lot of pace and good in the air as well, and Melander's more the interception king as well. Look at his interception skills, his shot power as well, I'll go on to that in a moment. And then whilst I show you some clips in the background, but he's, as I said, like the new Yaya Torre, like a Pogba as well, quite big, really strong as well, and obviously he'll do a great job for your team, and obviously really cheap as well, he's so cheap, even with, like I say, a championship team, you could just get him on loan, and he'll do a great job for a season, and maybe you can, like, put a future fee on, and get him for around, like, even under 5 million, that'd be absolutely insane, so, as I said, into the highlights, you can see of Melander, so this is actually taken uh, from, I think, episode number 10, uh, to episode number 15, just showing you a couple of highlights of Melander's kind of best moments so far this season, and a couple of moments when I went into, like, another career match just to see how he was. So you can see Melander there, look at the bit of pace there, and a great bit of play there into Pogba from the A in that last highlight. So again, you see he's just playing so well for us, and him and Pogba really linked up really well. You can see Melander with a great through ball there, into the pass, and that's Nabry as well. And so again, really good technical stats as well, really strong as well. All his stats seem to really go up, and imagine by the end of the career mode, I've heard people get him uh, to run up maybe 99 strength and like 95 pace, which is absolutely insane if you ask me. And he'll play really well, and once again, to like say four or five seasons, if I do actually get that far, uh, with Arsenal do a great job but as I said he's really big really good tackling as well and that's why I really do enjoy using him also good skills as well as he really got that kind of agility as well look at that pass out to the wing uh, to San uh, Santa Cazorla as well and just shows how good he is look at the strength just struggling the Hudson off the ball there with the shot as well uh, quite unlucky there maybe if his stats had gone up a little bit he would actually get probably get on target but as I said after maybe a season he'll probably go up to around about 80 I would say maybe around about 78 79 that kind of range and from then on he just fires up to around about 85 uh, by then, and I've seen a lot of people, as I said, again uh, to around my 88, which is absolutely insane. And I'd really love to get in, into that kind of stats in my Arsenal career mode in the future. So, if you guys have enjoyed this style of video, and if you do want to see more, remember to leave a like on the video. And also, if you do want to see kind of like these kind of videos, I kind of got the idea, kind of inspired by Carney Sports. If you haven't checked him out, there is somewhere on my sub box as well. He's actually there, and he's absolutely insane U a YouTuber. So, go and uh, check him out. He said it was fine to do this as well. So, go and check him out. He does like the more career mode player reviews and more detail as well. So, again, if you guys enjoyed, remember to leave a like. And also, I just wanted to get this video out uh, to show how good he is and if you guys do want to use him and just uh, like send screenshots of how like his potential got up to and what rating is for you guys so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video